flying donut, robotic receptionist or guidance droid. Whatever you want to call it, it's actually a mechanical balloon that's meant to help people navigate their way in difficult circumstances. It's still in its early stages, but this blimp could be the answer to a whole new level of convenience. Here's ABC Science reporter Sarah Clark. Lost or needing directions? Well, this could be your guiding light. We wanted uh, this blimp to guide guests who arrived at the CSIRO facility uh, to certain rooms, to a certain person or meeting rooms. The CSIRO is the blimp's first home, but one day this donut balloon could be helping you find your way through busy corridors. We chose the concept of a balloon because uh, this thing actually has to navigate around in you know, densely populated indoor areas, so the concept of you know, something like a helicopter wouldn't be very safe. How it works is there are three propellers that keep it en route and wireless sensors help it navigate obstacles. The scientific term is embedded intelligence. We see a future where these little devices are going to be embedded everywhere and so you'll have this ambient intelligence uh, no matter where you go. It's not just the blimp at work. Sensor nodes are scattered through the corridors to guide it on the best path to take. These can be used then in a whole host of different uh, pervasive computing environments. And for, for me personally, there's a few projects. One is to do with animal welfare monitoring. Uh, there's another one with um, uh, dementia patient tracking. And there's a whole host of scenario applications that uh, we're investigating that are uh, in general useful to Australians. The trial's just begun and there's no official name as yet. We came up with an idea of the guidance droid. So guidance droid, the autonomous blimp, is uh, kind of the idea we have right now. <laughs> and in the future, there may be no more excuses for getting lost and being late. Sarah Clark, ABC News.